Hi there, Rob here once again. Uh, I was asked to talk about uh, Bruce Coburn's cover of Blind Willie Johnson's Soul of a Man. Uh, first thing, and, and I'm just going to do this as quickly as I can, it's been kind of a long day. Um, uh, first thing you need to know is you got to be in an open C tuning. And that's going to be C, G, C, G, C, E. And let's just go into the structures. Well, actually, uh, first, uh, just put, uh, cover the, uh, oh, when I talk about strings, I'm going to talk about strings as though E, A, D, G, B, E, uh, regardless of the tuning. So when I say the B string, I mean the B string, even though it's tuned to a C right now. So uh, first thing you should do is cover the A string fifth fret. All right. And we're just going to talk about sort of the strumming pattern. I do not know how well I'm going to be able to describe this, but but you definitely want to uh, keep the Bruce thumb, uh, the, the Bruce hammer going. So... And, and, and you're, doing, uh, you're doing a percussive slap on the two and the four. So... forget to do that but um, it's very important to you know to keep that two and four slap going and and keep that drone drone e going all the time uh, so I don't know for the intro you're gonna have to figure it out for yourself but the, basically you're gonna be in the box on the, the third and the fifth fret so you can almost randomly slap fingers anywhere you want there and uh, and you probably aren't going to hit a bad note. Uh, the, the one signature sort of lick for this is the... So, B string open, uh, pull off, third fret, G string, into fifth fret, uh, D string. So... So B string, pull off, third fret, G string, into a hammer on, fifth fret, D string. Open G, fifth fret, D, third fret, D, open D, and then A string, ride it up, third to fifth. Do whatever uh, feels good to you. Um, this is not an exact transcription of how Bruce does it, um, but it, it's my version. So the first uh, chord structure, uh, bar, first four strings, third fret, um, and the A string, fifth fret. <laughs> Second chord, leave that finger on the A string fifth fret and also cover the G string fifth fret. Everything else open. Yeah, you can play the whole, you can, you can play all, all six strings. So. That's got to be 60% of the song right there. So, uh, question. Um, and then 
the turnaround I do is, oh gosh, uh, eighth fret uh, E string to third fret E string. It's a bit of a reach. Fifth fret B string. Third fret B string. call them out just do what I do okay so I'm gonna ask a question please answer if you can and and sometimes in the song instead of that turnaround I just do so uh, just bar the uh, first two strings, third fret, fifth fret. And my goodness, that really is 60% of the song. Uh, to the chorus. Um, G string, third fret, E string, third fret. To... G string second fret, E string first fret. Then D string fourth fret, B string fourth fret. Nah, third fret. Uh, D string third fret, B string third fret. Then open. Then A string and G string third fret. Well, open then third fret, hammer on. Well, not even hammer on, just so. <laughs> I can't even play anymore. It's 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 been a very long day, but. Um, while you're doing all this, you got to keep the drone going, so, and hammering on the, the second and the fourth. As you remember the uh, the two verse structures. cover everything as far as the basics uh, one more time I, I'm not certain if I if I explain that correctly um, third fret G string third fret E string second fret G string first fret E string third fret D string third fret B string well the, the slide up then to open then to third fret 
uh, kind of hammer on uh, A string and G string to open D string, B string. Uh, and sort of repeat the same structure, but... Uh, Keeping that trick with uh, the so uh, that's the song right there. Um, uh, gosh, I think after the third verse, uh, there's a little time there where you just sort of go nuts and 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 solo. Um, all I can tell you is that there's a lot of good stuff. <laughs> just in that box between third and fifth fret um, up at the 12th um, just just playing the, uh, the, the two notes off of the B and E string and the B and the G string there's some stuff there um, I'll tell you you know when I've had the right audience I've, I've even uh, just screwed around with it a little bit just to see who was listening um, and morphed into some Vince Gugliardi uh, the, the, the. Just, just, you know, in, in the usual places, there's there's great places to screw around. Um, so hopefully that will do it for you. Um, I'm not too sure what more I can add at this point. So uh, uh, this is what I promised, and, and I, I hope you have good luck with it. And thanks for watching.